Hey, Valley Meteorologist Brett Crandall here in the 24-7 Weather Center. Quite a windy day across the valley. Fortunately, though, we're seeing those winds die down at this hour. We saw winds up to 30 miles an hour in Brownsville earlier this afternoon, but since around 1 p.m., falling down into the low 20 mile per hour range at this hour. Overnight and into tomorrow, expecting those winds to continue out of the southeast, but below 20 miles an hour, most likely between 10 and 15 miles an hour throughout the day on Sunday. But then Sunday night into Monday, we see those winds come out of the north up to 25 miles an hour with a cold front. Much cooler temperatures headed our way with a decent chance for some shower activity on Monday morning as that front pushes on through. So for Sunday, well above average temperatures, once again around 80 degrees, but then the rest of the week, we're going to be well below average with a number of fronts making their way through the valley, keeping us a little on the chilly side. Overnight tonight, though, very mild conditions, mostly cloudy skies, temperatures in the mid-60s by lunch tomorrow, upper 70s for most of us. Mostly cloudy conditions across the valley tomorrow. Highs around 80 in Brownsville, 75 at the island. Mid to upper valley temperatures pushing into the mid 80s once again. 83 in McGowan and into Star County, 86 in Rio Grande City still with mostly cloudy skies. That front pushes across central Texas overnight tonight and continues to push southward throughout the day on Sunday, taking showers across much of north Texas, and then finally seeing the rain move through south Texas and into the valley late Sunday night into early Monday morning as that front pushes on through in the overnight hours, bringing a good chance for shower activity, through, especially throughout the morning hours in the valley. We're talking about a 60% chance of rain. So your 7-day forecast shows cooler than average temperatures all week long. Your overnight Temperatures on Monday night will be rather chilly, falling into the 40s early Tuesday morning, but finally rebounding into the 60s for your highs on Wednesday across the valley. Still expecting quite a bit of cloud cover, but Thursday looks like is the most dry day we're going to see this week. But still, quite a bit of rain in the forecast, so keep that umbrella handy and make sure your jacket is with you throughout the week.